Hello everyone. Welcome to another video brought to you by 360 Creations. Our affiliate is 360 Web Solution. Um, anyway, now what we're going to show you guys what to do today is a wraparound text, as you can see in this case, or image wrap, whichever you choose to call it, where you can you have your image and your text is wrapping around that image. So I'm using Dreamweaver CS4. CS3 should work the same. Uh, I've only used 3S3 for about a month and I've never actually done this on CS3 so I'm sure CS3 uh, would work the same so anyway what I'll be I'll be showing you how to guys how to do this today so let's close this out I'm gonna delete this image so okay let's say we want an image right where I had it before which is right here um, just put your mouse pointer right there click and right there where you want it to go go up to insert image if you don't have your image insert right here click this little arrow to the right and select image it will pop up ask you to browse you can browse for your image that you want but I already have mine selected so I'm gonna select that click OK it's a very very huge image so I'm gonna go back uh, which 360 website solution it's actually a website like a 360 web solution that's our affiliates they design websites for you um, anyway uh, let's go here um, I'm gonna rescale this um, I know I want this around say 200 pixels in width and I'm gonna do 150 pixels in height okay now that we have the it's still selected if you notice it's still not wrapping around our uh, our text is not wrapping around this image still even though we have it selected so let's go down here to where it says align select your image make sure your image is selected go down here where it says align click on align and click align left look what happens your uh, Whoops! If anyone knows how to do, before I go for it, anyone who knows how to debug Camtasia Studio Seven, I'm using Camtasia Studio Seven. It has bug. It won't let me drag or highlight anything when it's running. But anyway, um, this is how you do it. And as you can see, it's wrapping. If you double click your image again and you want it to go to the right, you just click align right, and see it aligns to the right as well. But so that's how you do text wrap. I'm going to put it back to the left and we're going to preview this in the browser. Um, go back to the left. I am going to save this. And I'm going to go here and preview in Google Chrome. There we go. As you can see, as we just started the video, it's the same thing. It's aligns to your left. So that's how it works. Feel free to comment, rate, subscribe. Please do, please do subscribe, especially because I want to get to that mark where I have a lot of subscribers where I can start making longer videos. I want to do uh, web design tutorials, how to design a website from scratch all the way through a complete site, database and all. So please subscribe, guys, so I can start doing stuff like that. Okay, thanks for watching. Hope this helps. You guys come back again when I'll be making more tutorials. See you guys later.